In this video we'll see how a chamfer is applied to a cabinet and how you can modify it. A chamfer is an angle cut on a panel's edge. You would use this feature typically when panels are joined at an angle, often for a door. So I've got a cabinet set up already. The left side is not perpendicular to the back or the front, it's at an angle and we've also put in here a simple door at the front. Let's show this cabinet in plan view so we can see better what's going on. The doors selected, I'm going to go into the links menu, go to the left side and we've actually got a slack on the door of 3mm. I'm going to take that out just so things are a bit clearer. So in the links menu you've got a chamfer option. It's set to default which means the angle of the cut is exactly in line with the angle of the left side. So that's the default. We can go in and change that to right edge minus. So typically you would want to cut the edge straight for ease and that's the setting you need to do that. You can also set the chamfer to right edge minus. You still get a straight cut with this option but the cut starts where the intersection of the left side meets the face of the the outside face of the door. We've got two more chamfer options which you may want to play around with for some extra design flexibility. Angle face one this looks like the default, but you've actually got an angle option now. Face one is this face of the door and the angle is this angle here between the face one, the outside face of the door and the panel edge. So I'm going to change that to 110 degrees and we've got now a different design to the door. Angle face two, so face two is the inside face of the door and the angle it's referring to is this angle here the angle between the edge and face 2. I'm going to change that to 40 degrees and you can see the impact. Again it's adjusted the angle of the cut of the edge. Thanks very much for watching. Goodbye.